Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Tony. So for today, as you can see, finally I'll be doing my Big Bad Wolf book haul. Yesterday I went to Big Bad Wolf Books PH VIP Day and I bought a lot of books. I bought uh, 24 books and plus one. So if you want to know what books I bought, their prices, let's hop into the video. So, um, before I start, I just want to tell you that um, there are books in Big Bad Wolf books. Oh, by the way, first of all, um, Big Bad Wolf books is until February 24. It's 24 7, so you can go there at 1 a.m., 2 a.m. You can go there anytime. It's open 24 7. Open always. And then, um, there are a lot of sections there. There are fiction, non-fiction, crime, thriller, science fiction, young adult, um, religion, children's, architecture, uh, graphic novels, uh, cooking, coloring book, and, and more. There are so many sections there and there are trade paperback they are, there are paperback hardbounds and others usually for trade paperback it's for fiction since i'm focused in fiction books mostly it's um 190 but there, there are also hardbound books that are priced 190 pesos so you gotta check because i bought books i picked up books that are trade paperback. But then I saw na meron din siyang hardback. And sometimes, parehas lang siya ng price. So, mas maganda bilhin yung hardback if mahilig kayo hardback. Or minsan naman, um, merong same book, trade paperback, and in hardback, 190 for example, yung trade paperback. And then yung hardback is, or hardbound copy is, um, 230 pesos. So, konti lang naman difference, but pero for me, I would choose a hardbound copy. So, okay, I will now be finally telling you the books that I bought. So, first of all, kasi ito yung pinakamalaki, Greek Gods. Uh, last Big Bad Wolf, I bought Greek Heroes, and it's also priced 350 pesos. Ito 350 pesos then, and um, I would say this is a steal. And because if you will look into um, National Bookstore or Fully Booked or some mga online bookstores, I would say na original price nito is 1,000 plus. Pero here at Big Bad Wolf, it's only 350 pesos. So if you're a fan of Rick Riordan's books, you should definitely buy this. Madami pang copy, so I think. Madami pa silang stocks. I think lahat naman makakabili ng gusto nila. May Greek Heroes din doon, pero I already bought my copy last year. And may Greek Gods na. So next is, hardback is, The Nowhere Girls by Amy Reed. This is 230 pesos. Nakikita ko to lagi sa Bookstagram and madami maganda ang reviews niya. So, nung nakita ko siya, I picked it up. Next is, um, nag-recommend sa akin nito is, oh, I forgot, um, I think, if I'm not mistaken, correct me, sa mga na-meet ko sa Big Bad Wolf books, um, si Yash, if, um, Yash, ikaw nga ba yung nag, um, ano sa akin nito, nag-recommend, I Let You Go by Claire McIntosh, madam, so na this silver in the blood, lagi ko to nakikita sa bookstagram, also booktube, and nagulat ako, merong copy siya sa, sa Big Bad Wolf books and I gotta tell you that this year akala ko talaga is kasi bago mag start yung VIP day hindi nag post ang Big Bad Wolf sa Facebook page nila or Instagram hindi sila masyado nag post ng selection ng books so before going to World Trade Center yesterday or before February 13 no February 12 naisip ko na ay baka hindi ako makabili ng books or makakabili ako konti lang kasi parang wala naman akong nagustuhan sa mga pinos nila or wala ako masyadong um, 
gustong bilhin. So, yun ang akala ko. <laughs> Pagdating ko dun sa World Trade Center, papasok ko sa Big Bad Wolf Box. And dun nga sa, nung wala pa ako dun kahapon. Kasi I arrived there at around 10 p 10, 10 a.m. And nakita ko yung mga posts ng, ni Book B. Nagpapost sila, sila ng mga pictures. Ang dami magagandang selection. And nung pumasok na ako, ang dami magagandang selection. So guys, if you have the time, and everything you should go to Big Bad Wolf Books. If you're a bookworm, you should go there. A lot of selection of books, a lot of genres, a lot of cheap books. So, yun nga. Silver in the Blood, this is by Jessica Day George. Although, um, ratings na to, nasa, if I'm not mistaken, 3 something, 3.4. So, binili ko na din siya. I am the claw, I am the wing, and I am the smoke. This is 230 pesos. Sunod is, uh, um, masaya ako pero nalungkot ako. Kasi nakita ko sa other, uh, sa past sales ng Big Bad Wolf Books, kompleto nila to sa ibang place. Pinagbenta, kompleto series. Though meron na akong, this is City of Lost Souls by Cassandra Clare. Although madami na akong copy ng books like Cassandra Clare. Pero gusto ko din kasi ng UK edition ng The Mortal Instrument. So, this is 190 pesos. Ito lang yung UK edition doon. Ewan ko kung maglalabas sila sa other days. Pero, uh, mapapagastos na naman ako kapag lumabas. Naglabas sila ng other box nitong TNI na UK edition. Pero, I'm happy that I got to buy one. Pero, malungkot din kasi ito lang yung edition UK edition na nandun kahapon. Pero, that's okay. That's 190 pesos. Sunod is Once Upon a River. Recommended by Ate Donna. Um, si Ate Donna yun. <laughs> Mahirap guys na madami kang kasamang bookworms kapag namimili. Sabi nga din na Ate Donna, recommend niya kay Gerald. Um, kasi magre-recommend sila na magre-recommend na must read. So, bibilhin mo na kasi you trust their judgment. <laughs> So, this is 290 pesos. Sabi ni Ate Donna, sobrang ganda daw nito. Or yung mga na-recommend, meron mga na-recommend sa akin dito si Ate Donna, si Gerald. Sabi niya maganda daw, so napabili ako. So, Once Upon a River by Diane Setterfield. Um, this is 290 pesos. Thank you, Ate Donna, for recommending this to me. I'll read them soon. Next is, um, sige, wag mo na to. Next is, an Enchantment of Ravens. Ang tagal ko din nakikita nito lagi sa Bookstagram. So, binili ko na siya nung nakita ko. By Margaret Rogerson. This is 230 pesos. Though, ang ratings niya medyo mababa. 3 point something something. Pero, okay lang. Um, depende naman yun sa reader kung magugustuhan niya talaga. Pero, yung mga binili ko nga is hope mga 3 stars pa tapos. Hindi ko na uh huh. With it written in the stars by Asia Said. <laughs> I could pronounce the name. Ano pa niyan I pronounce. Um, this is also recommended by Ate Donna. This is 230 pesos. So, di ba? Dami dito ng recommend ni Ate Donna. Ate Donna pahamak ka. <laughs> Pero um, you may budget kasi ako for Big Bad Wolf. Maximum is 5,000 pesos. And di naman ako nakalampas sa 5,000 pesos. Um, nasa, sinakto ko pala na 5,000 pesos. So, at least, uh, nasa within my budget. Next is The Adventures of Sherlock Holmes. This is by Arthur Conan Doyle. So, this is 290 pesos. Ang ganda niya. Uh, okay. I'll read them soon. Um, may question ako, guys. Kasi hindi ko pa nababasa ang mga books ni Sherlock Holmes. Pero ito Adventures of Sh Sherlock um, kailangan babasahin ko muna yung books niya or pwedeng basahin ko to as parang stand alone kahit hindi ko basahin yung mga past books niya or do I really have to read it before reading this? So, let me know, please. Um, next is, lagi ko din to nakikita sa bookstagram. This is one, a novel by Cindy Pond. Am I pronouncing their names correct? So, this is 230 pesos. Mm. Next is, um, sabi sa akin ni Ate Jokas, kasi tinanong ko, kasi nga last year, lahat ng Rick Riordan books na available sa Big Bad Wolf books, binili ko. And this is The Trials of a 
Apollo, uh, 230 pesos, of course, by Rick Riordan, book one of the Hidden Oracle. Sab, tinanong ko sa Ate Joka, sabi ko, Ate, meron ba nito last year? Sabi niya, wala daw. Or meron, paperback lang. So, binili ko na. It's, mm -hmm. Next is, um, this to pagsamahin ko na. The Golden Hand in Clariel by Garth Nix. Um, nung una pinag-iisipan ko talaga kung this is 230 pesos kung bibilhin ko to kasi nga um, hindi naman siya kompleto and parang pang third, fourth book na siya pero uh, tinan nyo kasi yung mga reviews reviews ni Holly Black Guardian, Sandra Clare, Philip Pullman D. Bardugo, Brandon Sanderson Sarah J. Mass so binili ko na siya. Kasi sabi din na ate doon na maganda daw ang books ni Garth Nix. So, I think this is worth it to buy. Kasi hardback naman siya, 230 pesos. And, um, yun nga, kukalektahin ko na lang yung whole series. Pero, so dalawa naman yun nabili ko sa series. So, that's okay. Next is, mm, ganda din ito. Um, I'm glad na naghintay ako ng sale and hindi agad ako bumili kasi yun, nagkameron nga siya sa Big Bad Wolf box. This is the City of Bones by Cassandra Clare. This is the 10th anniversary edition. So, kung bibili niyo to sa fully book, this is 1,000 plus. But I was only able to buy this book for 290 pesos. So, di ba? So, kailangan guys maging patient talaga kayo and mag for book sales kasi mas makakamura kayo dun um, if hindi naman kayo in a hurry to buy a certain book. This also is uh, is recommended by Ate Donna. Diba? Ang dami niya talaga na re-recommend sa akin. Pahama ka talaga Ate Donna. Joke lang. I love uh, If We Were Villains by ML Rio. Uh-huh. This is 200... 30 pesos. Meron din nitong ano, paperback. Kasi, kaso, syempre, mas gusto yun ko nga, I mentioned na I like hardback. So, yun ang binili ko. Hindi ko sure kung yung paperback is same price lang na 230 pesos. Kaya mas pinili ko to. Or 190 yung trade paperback. And then, 230 to. Kasi minsan kasi parehas lang ang price sa trade paperback at sa hardback. So, mas hardback na lang yung pipilin ko. This also is recommended by Ate Donna and Gerald the Bookworm. So, A Little Life. Though si Gerald, hindi niya pa nababasa, I think. And gusto niya nga basahin. So, nung nakita to na yung Ate Donna ng copy, last three na lang yon. So, for Ate Donna, uh, Gerald, and for me, A Little Life by Hanya Yanag... What? Hanya Yanagihara. Okay, hindi ko alam kung na pronunciation ko. So, yun. Ito siya. This is 230 pesos. Diba? Napaka worth it yung 230 pesos na mga hardback books. Meron pang mga ganito kakapal, pero 230 pesos na siya. Next is Stary Eyes by Jen Bennett. This is 190 pesos. Madami pa, tala Madami pa siya actually yung book doon, itong si Jen Bennett. Pero I chose Stary Eyes kasi tining iniskan ko nga yung books. And ito yung may pinakamataas na ratings. 4.1 something, I think. So, 190 pesos. Next is, oh, uh, ganda nito. Ito yung recommended din na read ni ate. Um, Donna. Pero, may, may, may copy na ako nito. Trade paperback. Na-complete ko yung series. Pero, I, then I saw this. I think this is a different edition kasi iba yung cover niya. And then, pang third book na to. Pero, it's hardback. So, I like it. Reaper at the Gates. Uh, by Sabah Tahir. Uh, okay. Um, don't mind my, mga, my pronunciations of their names kung mali. This is 290 pesos. So, yan. Next is, um, though, meron pa pala ako isang bilang enchantment of ravens. Doon dito sa akin para to kay, um, Yanni. 
nagpabili siya sa akin. So, this is 230 pesos. Meron na ba ako nabanggit na The Enchanted Akma? So, pangalawang book na to. So, uh, parang na to kay Yanni. Get it from me! Kailangan may libre. Joke lang. Um, sunod is Angel Fall by Susan E. This is 190 pesos. So, sabi sa kanin ni Nicole, uh, out of all, kasi nabanggit ko na gusto ko makabasa or I'm interested sa mga stories sa mga fallen angels and everything. And sabi niya, out of all the fallen angel stories, ito yung pinakamaganda. Angel Fall by Susan E. Um, if I'm not mistaken, this is a trilogy. But there is also a second book there, the Big Bad Wolf box, World After. This is 190 pesos then. Nicole, bukod Nicole, may nagbanggit Nicole. Napaka bastos na maritone. Ati Nicole, sabi ni Ati Nicole is um ah yun nga maganda to. May nagbanggit pa sa akin, di ko alam si Yash ata or sino ba? Uh, I forgot ko sino pa yung isa nagsabi sa na out of all na, na Fallen Angel Stories. Ito yung maganda. So, next is The Darkest Part of the Forest by Holly Black. Hindi ko maalala kung may copy na ako nito o wala. Pero binig binili ko siya. 190 pesos. So, it's because it's Holly Black's. I love Holly Black's books. So, yes. And then for the last, this I did not buy at Big Bad Wolf Books. Pero thank you at Tedayan Books and then some for buying this for me sa fully book. Kasi nga, limited copies lang to sa fully book. And I've already read this. I mentioned it in my wrap app. And I finally have my own copy. Regretting You by Colleen Hoover. So this is 675 pesos. Siguro itong murang book ni Colleen Hoover sa... Fully book. Kasi normally, ang mga book ni Colleen Hoover sa fully book is priced 700 something. So, 675 lang to regret in you. Definitely recommend this book. And yeah, thank you Ate Diane for buying this for me. So, yun guys. That's it. That's the books that I bought for myself. Yun yung mga books na nabili ko para sa sarili ko. Meron din kasi iba nagpasabay sa akin. And andun pa sila sa bag doon. And yun! <laughs> and... Um, I hope you enjoyed this video and hindi ko alam guys kung sa pagpunta nyo meron pang mga copy kasi baka may nagustuhan kayo sa mga na-mention ko or nabili kong box so hindi ko alam kung may maubutan ko kayong copy doon kasi like meron daw The Cruel Prince doon pero saglit lang siya hindi ko na siya naabutan wala na ako nakita ng copy although meron na naman ako pero Wala. Gusto ko lang may makita and may mga nagpapabili sa akin pero hindi ko na nga siya naabutan. So, yun. As much as you can or if you really have the time, I would really, really, really recommend going to Big Bad Wolf Books if you're a bookworm or if you love books because it's once a year only. It's 24-7 so you can go anytime. It's until February 24. There are a lot of cheap books, a lot of generous, a lot of selection of books, a lot of selection of great books. So, yes, I would recommend um, going there. And yun nga guys, if pupunta kayo dun, kung may time naman kayo and wala nang kayo ibang pupuntahan, Maganda ko ikutin niyo yung buong area. Ako, um, nakailang ikot ako doon sa area. Dalawa ata or tatlong beses. And kasi may times na kahit isang beses ka na umikot doon, meron ka pang books na hindi nakikita or hindi mo napansin na gusto mo pala, na nandun pala. Or minsan na nagre-replenish or nagre-restock sila, naglalagay ng mga panibagong books. So maganda kong... Balik ulit kayo, ikot ulit kayo. Or balik na lang ulit kayo sa Big Bad Wolf box. I'm not sure if I'll be able to go there again. Hopefully. Kasi gusto ko palit bumalit. Pero ayaw ko nang gumastos. Um, yun. Uh, book buying ba ako ng March. So, yeah. And I'm super happy because besides book hunting, I was able to 
meet a lot of bookworms, friends from Bookstagram, for, from Booktube that I uh, na finally na meet ko sila in person. And yeah, I'm super happy. And thank you guys for the time sa mga nakilala ko and nakasama ko. Thank you. And it was nice to meet you. So guys, that's it. That's my book haul for this year's Big Bad Wolf books. PH 2020. So if you have any questions, just comment down below and I'll try to answer as soon as I can. So thank you guys for watching. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, kindly subscribe down below and click the bell button so you'll get notified when I upload my next video. And um, thank you guys for watching. See you in my next video. Keep smiling, stay positive, and I hope we meet in Big Bad Wolf soon if makakapunta ulit ako. Uh, kayo sa Big Bad Wolf box. I would definitely recommend going there. So bye guys, God bless.